Welcome back to Wasteland 3. So, when we last left off, we cleared a good chunk of the warrens. And there's actually an entrance to the prison block right here. And a few more bad guys in the back. We'll go clear them out. How's our quest progress? Yeah, this quest is now green, which means it's like quite a bit lower than I am, but that's okay. This one is basically done. These are the quests for the warrens. So yeah, we are supposed to clear the warrens. That's basically the objective. We will definitely do that. And the other quest was, yeah, this one. <laughs> Search the warrens for ramen noodles. I don't know if we'll find that, but we will definitely clear the place. Yeah, green quest is a quest at least five levels lower than our characters. All right, let's go this way. There was a guy in the back. Uh, more than one. Yep. Okay. Oh, hi. Wait, hot? Why did the camera move? That was weird. Fire! Okay, that was uh, way less damage than I hoped it will be, but all right. So, let's see. This is a bit of an awkward spot for a fight, because there's not a whole lot of cover we can use. That's my concern. Oh, same damage, he just has more health. All right, well, let's take a shot at him. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit crowded. Not much I can do about that. Not quite sure if we can kill him, we'll see about that. We need a good damage. Right here. With the sniper rifle. Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. That was almost the maximum non-critical damage we did. I'll take it. Not quite sure if we can kill him, though. Maybe. The lack of cover is really concerning, though. I have a bad feeling about that. Okay, good one. Not enough AP. I might be able to kill him. It's basically up to Lucia. Alright, make it a good one. As long as we hit him, this will actually kill him, right? Yeah, he has no armor left. Uh, no, he has five armor. But this should kill him. We got 13 penetration, he's down. And we can move into cover. So how about we do that? Uh, well, if I move here, I might get flanked. If I move here, I will also get flanked. So that's not great. How about we prepare to get plus two action points on the next turn? Same with Bear, he can move slightly closer. We can only save up to two APs for the next turn. And our sniper, yeah, stay back here. Prepare. That leaves us with Higgs. Let's move him up all the way here. Okay. And I think that will do, basically. Let's see what they got. Yeah, they will light up the pigs. The pigs can move a lot. I don't think this one can 
blow up in my face. I hope not. If they stay close to each other, that might be a good moment to use a grenade. Uh, that's a lot of pigs. Okay! Uh, that was pretty loud. And Higgs is down. But that was kind of loud. <laughs> Rip headphone users. Okay, yeah, Higgs is down. Uh, Lucia is still fine, barely. 9 HP out of 99. Well then, I think this requires some more firepower. Lieutenant Giggles, what kind of name is that? Let's throw the grenade. And probably back up or something. I can use med hypo. And then I can still take a shot if I want to. I'm semi-tempted to use a rocket here. I do have nine rockets. Nuke strike? Wait, what? Fire a nuclear... Wait, seriously? What the heck? There's an actual nuke strike ability? That will leave a cloud of radiation behind though. And I do not currently have any medical items that can remove radiation. But now I really want to see this. <laughs> I actually really want to see this. But I don't want to leave a cloud of radiation behind. Okay, yeah, we might just try this later. Right now I want to use a regular rocket. So, like this. Because if I leave a cloud of radiation behind, I will not be able to enter the room. And I do not have the items that are required to cure radiation. So we'll use it some other time. Let's just go with the regular rocket right now. I do have nine rockets, so whatever, just use it. Here. And we still have six APs. Which means I can still take a shot with my machine gun. If I want to do that. Might be better to move. This is still going to be tricky. This might be a good moment to use the medical dart, actually. And then take a shot. I need the damage. Okay. Now precision strike. Oh yeah, so this is an option again. But I think in this case we'll go for the headshot. We don't need an instant kill, I just need good damage. There we go, he's down. Alright. I do also have torrent strike. If I use it right now, I will hit my own clone and a rabbit with it. But it will do good damage. As an alternative, we can just take a regular shot. If I use this, I will hit my own clone and the rabbit. So maybe not the best idea. Let's go for a normal shot here. That guy in the back has over 500 HP total. As in, that was his max. That's a lot of health. Okay, now I can get Higgs up, but I don't want him to get downed again, because that would give him two injuries. I will use a med hypo. And take a shot. Okay, good one. We still got Fox. We are slightly out of range there. I wasn't going to 
kill that lieutenant anyway. Not on this turn anyway. And that leaves us with ice, but only 5 AP left. Hopefully they will target the clone. Oh, right. He has the flamethrower. Okay. I might have to replay this fight. Uh, Alright, I think I'll have to replay this fight. You know what we could do instead? We could just use that nuke ability. Yeah, I need to replay the fight because we're basically dead. Well then, uh, let's replay in that case. I had no way to kill them that quickly though. This is a nasty fight because I can't spread out, there's no room to spread out. And we got three pigs inside. No good way to kill the pigs. What I could do is leave one person as bait in the front. So that person would take huge damage from the pigs, but nobody else would take damage from the pigs. Alright, so let's try this again. So, hold on. Yeah, I need one more shot to charge up the nuke. So I cannot open with it, unfortunately. Oh, hold on. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't loot this stuff. Uh, Alright. That was a slightly earlier save. Eh, doesn't matter. Wait, why did this guy come here now? Is he actually going to talk now? No, he's not. No idea what his deal is. Get over here. Alright, so let's do this again. So, yeah, this is going to be tricky. Who's the most tanky person we got? Probably Bear, with 144 HP. Yeah, pretty much. So let's have him in the front. Yeah, I don't know why the camera moves like that. I guess it, it like wants that. to show us what's going on in here. So unfortunately I can't open with a nuke because it's not fully charged. I'm going to keep most of the group in the back to avoid the pigs. And the bear will take a shot. Bear is basically bait. He's big bait. <laughs> Sorry, bear. What the heck? How is that not a permitted term? <laughs> anyway. So, okay, I got four more AP. I can still back up slightly. Maybe the pigs will not be able to reach me. So let's just back up slightly. I know they can move a lot. And then we can ambush with everyone else in the back. Works for me. Ambush for everyone. There should be like a hotkey for ambush or something. In before the pigs are still close enough. Yeah, the bunny is actually pretty nice with plus 10% initiative. The best possible outcome here would be to blow up the pigs on top of them. Now that would be amazing. If I could blow up three pigs on top of them... Yeah, the problem is that they can run so far. However, they did not blow up. 
That's good. That right there will save me a ton of damage. I planned. You didn't. Alright, let's just use the nuke. I want to see how this works. I want to see the nuke. So, what the heck? We are using the nuke. Right here. We can hit all four of them. So, nuke away! Okay, that's pretty nice! The mushroom could have been a little bit better. But that was pretty nice. Not quite sure what the radiation effect is. Now, we need to deal with this pig. Let's back up. Hey, ambush is basically overwatch. Okay, back up, away from the pig. Uh, back up slightly with Higgs. He could probably just heal himself, actually. Uh, no, he's not the guy with the medkit. Who had the medkit again? Kwon had the medkit. Uh, that will do. Thank you. All right, and we can still take a shot at the pig. I need to try blowing up all of them. That's kind of important. Yeah, the damage on the nuke could have been a bit better. I agree. But it might have been a little bit too overpowered in that case. Can we kill both the pigs in the back? I hope so. Out of range. And not quite enough damage. Oh, I kind of blocked the way. So, Fox needs to move one more time. Seriously, miss with a 92%. Are you kidding me? Well, that sucked. Uh, that seriously sucked. I can't move any closer. I'm just slightly out of range of that pig on the left. I can't kill them both. Well, that sucks. I only have my sniper left, so... I was hoping to kill the one on the left with the revolver and the other one with the sniper, but I guess that's not happening. Yeah, so this one will probably blow up in my face. And these guys might use... Oh, never mind. They killed the pig. With their own flamethrowers. With that said, I still need to kill them quickly, otherwise... I will run into the same exact problem as earlier. We'll get roasted with the flamethrowers. So, yeah. I don't know if I can kill them quickly enough. I can throw everything I have at them. I might just use another rocket. Even though, you know, they are kind of expensive and rare. But I feel like I kind of need it. Okay, let's just go with it. Now they are too spread out. I can't hit all four of them anymore. Let's hit these three and not hit our clone. Okay. I definitely can't kill all four of them on this turn. That is not happening. Let's see. Do we have any special abilities charged up? That's almost charged up. Nope, nothing is charged up at the moment. Let's see then. 
Okay, only 89 HP on that guy. I can kill that guy. As long as we hit. There we go. One down. And this is still a problem, though. So, that's the shotgun. I think we're better off uh, taking more shots with the revolver rather than using a shotgun. I can take two shots. So if we move slightly closer, I can take two 92% shots. I'll take it. I have to kill at least one of them, otherwise I'm kind of screwed. I would prefer to kill two of them, but I don't think that's happening. The big one, Lieutenant Giggles. What kind of name is that? <laughs> well, Wasteland style name. I don't have Torrent Strike now. The downside is... If I want to hit all of them, I will hit Higgs. Which is probably not a great idea. Not to mention, I will also hit the clone. So, no. We can use Precision Strike with the Battle Rifle, though. So, this would give me 33% chance to kill him outright. I don't know if I'll get lucky with that twice in a row, but we can still try. There it is! It actually worked! Well then, <laughs> that was pretty good. But I'll try to not make it a habit to rely on that hitting. Uh, also, we're not done yet, so let's not get too excited. We still got two of them. Yeah, this was a really, really nasty fight. We better get a really good reward out of this. Uh, yeah, just checking their health. Yeah, this guy is in cover, which means I have a lower chance to hit him. Okay, nice one. That's exactly what I needed. Got him, and that's a level up for Fox. Now he has... Uh, well, even more points to spend. I can't kill the last guy because he's in cover. So... Yeah, that's not happening. I'll just try to take this shot. I don't have a lot of options. If he didn't have that cover, I could actually kill him. But that was a really good turn. Unfortunately, we'll take a flamethrower to the face. So that part kind of sucks. I might have to heal myself. I don't think I can, like, remove that effect otherwise. Yeah, I'm going to need actual heals. We can use the medic packs. Let's actually kill him first. Done. So... Yeah, that was a tough fight. It really was. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, she's burning. I don't think I can pause uh, right now. Come on, heal. There we go. Yeah, I just don't want anyone to die from that effect. Done. Yeah, that was a tough fight, man. That was a really tough fight. For several reasons. Let's see what we get out of this. A loot from the corpses. Some injury kits. And let's check the room. 
More loot. A rocket. We got two rockets. Sure, I'll take that. Thanks. I'm going to quick save just in case. And the radiation cloud is gone, so that's good to know. I was a little bit worried it will block our way in. Wait, what? Oh, come on! Are you kidding me right now? Shouldn't they, like, run around that or something? I'm glad I quick saved. Good thing I quick saved. Let's try that again. Without slicing our faces. Also, I didn't see if we actually finished the quest or not. We did not finish the quest, alright. Yeah, solid painting. So, uh, yeah, let's not slice ourselves. Medical crate. There isn't really anything in here other than the medical crate. So, yeah, let's not run into that thing again. Okay. Are there even more down here? It sounds like there will be more. Yep. Okay. Let's open the safe. Perfume. Mission critical item. Okay. Oh, uh, that's for uh, the person at the entrance, right? To deal with the pig smell. Okay. So, open the door. I see at least one guy in there. Okay, several. A nitrogen tank. Let's shoot the nitrogen tank. There are a lot of them in here. And not as many dudes with flamethrowers, though. Okay, we'll just do it like this. They spotted us! You think so? They spotted us? No idea how. We were very sneaky. I'll try to not waste too many rockets, so... Yeah, let's maybe not use a rocket here. I can take a shot and then move slightly, but I will not be able to move into cover. No, I will be able to move into cover. Nice. We can move forward. And then we will be in cover. Okay, I think ambush will be the best option here. Uh, yeah, it seems it did give him all his AP back. Alright, let me think about this for a second. I can't have everyone in cover, that's for sure. The revolver people have the lowest range, so they should be kind of in the front here. And we'll go with ambush. Precision strike is up, but I have no line of sight. Let's just ambush with everyone. My main concern are the flamethrowers. I don't see anyone with a flamethrower. I see a dude with a giant hammer, so that's a thing. Uh, that's not a flamethrower. It was mostly that previous group that was really, really nasty. Four dudes with flamethrowers. And a very narrow area. So that was a nasty fight. How much health does this guy have? Quite a bit, apparently. I yeah, 518. Okay. And he will swing that stupid hammer. Well, yep. 
Okay, fine. Weird stand as well. Go, go, clone. <laughs> the clone actually did decent damage. What the heck? With his fists. Alright. So we do have precision strike. Let's shoot this fella. That should be an instant kill, basically. Yeah, 483 damage. It's just that this guy in the front is too close, and my chance to hit would have been... Although, I think it would have been fine with precision strike, actually. Okay, hold on, hold on. I need to actually kill him. He has, like, extra evasion or something. Alright. Nothing else is charged. 95. Seriously, you missed with a 95? Come on! There, he's dead. And we charged up Precision Strike. And it, like, refunded my APs? And now they are out of range, for sure. Okay. Yep, that's like... How many 95% misses did I get so far? A few too many, in my opinion. Okay, let's be slightly more careful here. We're not done yet. Oh, there's an oil tank bank here. Uh, that sounds bad, because we're pretty close to it. Go, go, clone! <laughs> that clone is actually pretty decent! Oh, the provost helped us. He actually killed uh, that one melee guy in the front. Nice. Well then. Alright. Let's see. We do have precision strike charged up. Let's just make use of it. Headshot. Nice, instant kill. And that leaves us with one more dude in the back. With 200 health left. Slightly out of range here. Decent, considering we had 60% chance. One sniper shot would finish the job. Okay, not with 17%. Especially when ammunition is not free. He's almost down. He's inside, like, smoke, which means my chance to hit is quite a bit lower. Can we finish him off? I might have to use Ambush to finish him off. Seventeen percent? Okay, seventy-seven. And we missed. Of course we did. Are you kidding me? Well, never mind. Still got one chance. Uh, five chances, technically. He's down. Nice. Well, that was a pretty good fight. Way easier than the previous one. Let's check out the loot. And hey, Provost helped. He actually helped quite a bit. He killed one guy basically on his own. Clown Hammer. Don't quite need it right now, but maybe we'll get someone mala in the future. Injury kit. And let's see what's going on here. A toaster. Level 5. Yes, we can actually do that. Right? 
Uh, no. Because I would need one more skill point. I'm pretty close to a level up. If I can get a level up, I could actually get that toaster, because I have one equipable item that will give me plus one toaster repair, but then I need one more skill point to get toaster repair four. So, yeah. Meanwhile, let's spend the attribute point really quick. Or just save it. Uh, I think I'll come back here though, because I would definitely like to get whatever you would get from the toaster. Let's just check out everything else first. Vending machine. Customer protocol. Valued customer. Enjoy the fabulous gifts, little vendor. What? What is happening to me? My fabulous price. Well, we got that. Oh! The price was the ramen noodles, really? What the heck? <laughs> okay, that's kind of hilarious. Insert the no. silver coin. No, I refuse. I will not, my riches, please. <laughs> uh, I think that was another way of getting the ramen noodles. Have an well, we got day. that done. Uh, that wasn't, like, you know, for a level up, was it? Uh, no. He's so close, look at this. He's 50 experience away from a level up. I need 50 experience. From something, anything. Come on, 50 experience. Then we can get the toaster. Okay, there's another door. So there might be more enemies. I think we'll still get a chance to get 50 more experience. Let's grab all the loot first. Okay, well... Let's see if we can get more experience. We're not done with the clear Warren's quest yet, are we? We are not. So there are definitely more of them in here. How big is this place? What the heck? We are down here. Okay, this has to be the last room, right? Hello? Anyone home? I see a grenade box. Hello? Silver coin. Hurry up with that coin yep, now. okay, there are more dudes in here. Back up, back up, back up, back up! <laughs> Any flamethrower guys? No? No. Uh, I guess we are maybe supposed to save this person right here. No, that's a corpse. <laughs> it's kind of tempting to just use a rocket here, I'm not gonna lie. How many more rockets do we have left? Let me check. Should be like... Okay, we got 13. I'm just going to blast them with a rocket. This is clearly the best way to open. Yeah, we can hit them both and make the barrel explode. So, yeah, let's just spread out slightly. Lucy and Marshall in the front. Okay, let's do this. Wait for the other guy to come back. Maybe I can hit like three of them. Hold on, uh, I need to move a bit closer, I think. Okay, I can't hit three of them, but let's... I could almost hit three of them. Yeah, he's moving again. I'm just trying to maximize my damage. Okay, let's do it. There it is, nice! Okay, I love rockets, man. Alright. Still need to kill them, mind you. Might be able to kill one of them. Yep, this should be a kill right there. Uh, this will be a safer kill. Just don't miss a 95% again. There we go, he's down. That will leave a mark indeed. 
can we kill the other one? I just need to be a little bit closer. I should be able to finish him off. And this might not be no no, this is not going to be anywhere close to enough damage. There's not a whole lot of cover I can use, however. So we might as well take that shot. Okay. I mean, in theory, I might be able to kill him. I might be able to kill him, actually. There it is. He's down. Uh, no, he's not. He's at 4 HP out of 344. Seriously? Seriously. Okay. At least it's not one. Okay, we only got one enemy left. And then we can get the toaster, because this will give us enough experience for sure. Ambush. No, not you. Okay. What is he doing? You oh, are going to he was die. like demoralized or something. That's not going to help you, buddy. Yeah, he doesn't really stand a chance. Nice one. And he's shocked as well. We are done. And there's the level up. Uh, Lucia got a level up as well. Let's pick out the toaster skill right away. So we need five. I can actually get five right away, but I don't need five. I need four. And then we just need to equip the toaster bonus item. Yeah, there it is. Toaster repair plus one. Here you go, and then we can pick up the perk that will give us bonus loot from toasters. Oh, fixing broken toasters now yields toast. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. I don't know why you need a special perk to get toast from a toaster, but all right. I only have one, however, so we'll take the bonus loot. Toast is basically like a really good healing item. But let's get the toaster expert here. There we go. And we'll check out this room first. Grenade box. Uh, what's that sound? Smoke grenades, injury kits. Medic packs. Heavy machine gun. Uh, this is going to be an upgrade. Not a huge one, but this is better than my current heavy machine gun, I think. Is it? Let's take a look. I think it is. Which one was it? Not that one. This one. Uh, yeah, it's... I would have to mod it, I think. It has better penetration. It also has center mass ability. I would probably use it uh, when we just need a little bit of damage. And we don't care about how much it's going to be, like against enemies that are almost dead. Yeah, okay, that is going to be better. Do we have any weapon mods right now? 
Uh, yeah, that's the energy damage mod. I don't want that. Plus four damage. I'll save that for a higher level weapon. But this would be really good on a weapons like this that fire multiple times. Don't think it's worth using it on this. This is only a level three heavy machine gun. We'll wait for something better than that. Ammo box. Oh yeah, we triggered some alarm, but there's nobody left alive. <laughs> Looks like we got everything in this room. What's up with this corpse? Oh, uh, I got a key, apparently. Alright. Not sure what it opens, but I guess it will open something. Let me save really quick. Have we finished the quest yet, or is it still not done? It's still not done, what the heck? Yeah? Frost Chlorer, what the heck? 1000 HP? Uh, Alright. This also looks kind of bad. Are these traps or just a weird floor? This looks suspicious. Uh, oh yeah, uh, right, let's go get that toaster. <laughs> I thought I could maybe like finish the quest, but apparently not yet. Let's go get the toaster. Better be something good. Armor mod? Okay, that was not really worth it, to be honest. We got an armor mod. With plus on armor, plus 6% evasion. This token is... I don't know if it's junk. It usually says junk on it. If it's junk. I think it's junk, though. Okay. So... Right, maybe we can kill that big worm. And yes, there's still something back here, but we can't do everything all at once. Let's go deal with that worm if we can. And hey, the toaster skill will be useful one way or the other, even if this particular toaster was kind of bad. Alright, I don't like the look of that thing, but let's kill it. Uh, hopefully we'll kill it. But that is a lot of health. So... Okay. Let's unload everything we got. Hold on, 9 AP. Uh, I don't think I can kill it before it gets a chance to attack us back. Uh, seems unlikely. Unless we get like a monster crit. Which we might. The sniper rifle is not charged, however, is it? And now it's not. 140. Yeah, I will not kill it before it attacks back. Hopefully it doesn't do too much damage, but it does look nasty. It's at half health. Definitely can't kill it, but it is at half health. 
pretty sure cover will not matter against it. Okay, that's a nice shot. I needed more like that. We actually killed it! No, 38 HP. Uh, tell me I have like one more shot on somebody. Are you kidding me? I don't have any more shots on anyone. Come on, man. Seriously? That's dirty. That's dirty. Okay, well, apparently... That's the best we can do. <laughs> I hope it doesn't do too much damage. Cryoblast. Yep, I knew it's going to have some kind of AoE. The clone is going to kill it. Oh, that's hilarious. It almost killed it. There, the provost killed it. <laughs> I thought the clone is going to kill it for a moment. Yeah, we took some unnecessary damage, but I already did a ton of damage to it. So, oh well. This better be worth it. Uh, okay, not really. A gold nugget. That is nice. That's 2,000 gold, basically. But that's not uh, because you would al uh, always get it. That's because I have a special quirk on Fox. Yeah, that's from my quirk on Fox. But the downside is that he gets one less quick slot. So that's a pretty big downside. Uh, can you even see quirks anywhere here? Like, what screen do you see quirks on? Here. That's something you pick at the start of the game. That basically gives him a chance to find gold nuggets, but at the expense of having minus one a quick slot for other items. So he gets one quick slot here, but he has a chance uh, to find gold nuggets. Yeah, uh, I already checked the corpse. I think we're done here. Yeah, all that extra damage we took was a bit unnecessary, but oh well. I did my best to kill the worm. So there blessing. are more those in here. For the first time since the world ended, I feel hopeful again. Yeah, I assume there are more enemies in here. Uh, however, we are at 53 minutes, 54. So uh, I'll make a cut here and continue in the next one. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did or a dislike if you didn't. And subscribe for more daily videos. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.